Hi there, I'm Herb Calling, and uh, I'm a stamp collector, as you can see, with all this sort of thing on my dining room table. Uh, just basically do it and have done it uh, since I was a kid, and I've kept it up and rather enjoy the, the thing. And this stamp that I have here in my hand is kind of a bogus stamp. It's from Lundy, a place in England, and it's uh, in a denomination of three puffin. And three puffin, of course, is not a currency, but they sold these on this little uh, vacation island off the coast of Devon in England, um, to tourists and they'd actually stamp them in the little post office that they had and eventually the Queen got wind of it uh, her husband of course being a very uh, avid ph philatelist and uh, so they said okay if you're gonna sell those to tourists we'll accept them as postage and you can ship them anywhere in England to relatives and friends all, as long as they come from the island and that's a little story about this particular stamp that's a bit bogus but has a little provenance to it I consider myself a, a stamp collector rather than a philatelist, but I'm hoping to become a philatelist primarily because I'm now the editor of the Canadian Philatelist, which is a stamp magazine that runs across the country. It's about 64 or 68 pages. It uh, comes out uh, every second month, and so there are six editions a year, and I'm looking forward to it because it should be a lot of fun. Of course, I'm retired, and uh, this will give me something to do in my retirement.